Good MMO games for mobile devices have become increasingly sought after over the last few years. A big reason for their popularity spike is the fact that developers can now create large and immersive console-like games on mobile. That's why today I am back with the 10 best new MMORPGs on Android and iOS which you must have to play. But before going ahead, I want to say thanks to NordVPN for sponsoring. NordVPN is the best award-winning VPN that offers you 5200 plus super fast servers over 59 countries. If you have a concern about your privacy and data protection, then NordVPN will be really helpful for you. If you're a gamer like me and want to play a game that isn't available in your country, no problem. Just change your virtual location through NordVPN and play the game smoothly. You can watch TV series and movies online as well, so you can enter the content of other regions by simply changing your IP location. Because of the secure encryption, you won't have to worry about getting DDoS attacks or anyone getting your personal information online. It has a cyber secure suite which acts as an ad blocker. In addition, NordVPN offers a faster connection with Nord Links with no data logging and you can connect up to six simultaneous connections and double data encryption technology is very cool. NordVPN provides 24-7 customer support and it even works in China. It's compatible with most operating systems including Linux, Windows, Android, iOS and macOS, and NordVPN is recommended by top technology experts, so take back your internet privacy today and go to nordvpn.com slash down to top or use a coupon down to top to get a two-year plan plus a bonus gift with a huge discount. Starting with number 10, RuneScape. This is an MMORPG take place in a mythical fantasy realm divided into kingdoms, regions, and cities. With no linear story, players are able to make their own adventure by slaying monsters, trading, and crafting in a vast open world. Like any good MMO, the objective in RuneScape changes drastically from player to player. Maybe you want to complete every one of the over 200 quests to solidify your legendary hero status. Maybe you want to master one of the 28 skills for the illustrious skill Mastery Cave. Maybe you want to make billions flipping items at the grand exchanges. Number 9. Nino Kuni Crossworlds This is an MMORPG developed by Level 5 and Netmarble for mobile. With beautiful cell-shaped graphics, high-quality cutscenes, and background music of the Nino Kuni series, players can feel like they are going on a journey in an animation. The game was also built with Unreal Engine 4 and has continued to look excellent in each aspect so far. Nino Kuni Cross Worlds includes PvP, PvE, and multiple playable classes. Also, it has real time hack and slash combat system, which is really cool. Overall, it's a great game, but some players are also complaining and have accused it of being a pay to win game, so just something to keep in mind. Number 8 MU Archangel. This MMORPG brings elements from the MU universe since it's a spin off of the original title, MU Online. MU Archangel features much of the same from its core version, including Devil Square, Blood Castle, World Boss, and Ancient Battlefield. Gameplay wise, MU Archangel will see you hunting down bosses, clearing dungeons, collecting loot, upgrading your equipment, training with fellow guild members, and much, much more. Best of all, you don't need to stress about breaking items due to upgrade failure. MU Archangel takes its design cues from a simpler, better time. Number 7. My Hero Academia The Strongest Hero My Hero Academia has been a fan favorite with its fighting scenes, friendship, and different unique quirks. Moreover, with the renewal of the fifth season, the hype is not dying anytime soon. Speaking about the game, My Hero Academia is set in an open world action RPG. Players have to build their own team rosters with Class 1A students, pro heroes, and villains to use in story mode. PvP, and co-op mode. The game is free to play, however, it does include in-app purchases. But on top of all that, the game has outstanding graphics that perfectly fit the original look of the anime. And finally, My Hero Academia is available in English and available in North America. Number 6. Ragnarok X Next Generation This is a brand new, officially licensed adaptation of the original classic, allowing players to once again relive their blissful days in the land of Midgard with their friends. As you level up, you'll get a chance to explore more maps, 
The Great Five Cities of Midgards. There are six original classes in the game. All in all, Ragnarok X puts its own modern coat of paint over the good old Ragnarok Online formula. Despite its newer features and quality of life changes, it remains the same BGM, as well as its familiar characters, both enemies and player classes alike. And it has an interesting monetization mechanic that doesn't immediately put free-to-play players at a disadvantage. Number 5. AC Still Alive This is a hybrid game that allows for both MMORPG and Battle Royale fans to enjoy a top-down hack and slasher. The game offers the flexibility for players to play a traditional open-world MMORPG with quests, bosses, dungeons, PvP, leveling up, and more. However, there's a completely separate Battle Royale mode where you can enter to fight other players and try to be the last one standing. The biggest con of A3 is that it's an auto-battle idle system, and the monetization model is pretty offensive. But beyond that, it's definitely one of the more polished MMORPGs on mobile that I've ever played with beautiful graphics, immersive cutscenes, and responsive controls. Number 4. Odin Valhalla Rising this is an MMORPG developed by Lionheart Studio with Unreal Engine 4 based on Norse mythology, depicting the long war between humans, demons, and gods. The game has a vast, seamless open world where you can explore and complete different quests. The game offers all the traditional MMORPG features that one can expect in an MMO game. Mounts, dungeons, instant dungeons, boss battles, party systems, and much more will be seen in the game. However, sometimes the game looks pretty similar to Lineage 2M. Also, it has great character customization and beautiful graphics, but now it's only available in South Korea. Number 3. Albion Online This one's a traditional MMORPG set in a gigantic medieval fantasy world that offers the real multi-platform experience. The game features a player-driven economy where nearly every item is player-crafted and PvP is open world. Graphically speaking, the game actually looks a lot like RuneScape, except with much more polished visuals. Albion Online offers classless combat system, big world to explore, and has a vast skill system that allows players to customize and grow their characters exactly how they want. Those looking for a unique player-driven MMO should find a lot to like in Albion Online. Let's move on to bonus game Diablo Immortal. This game was announced in late 2018 by Blizzard and will be the first Diablo entry designed for play on mobile devices. The game takes place between Diablo 2 and Diablo 3 and acts as a bridge between the two stories. Like almost all Diablo games, Immortal is an isometric, top-down hack-and-slash MMO where you battle hordes of minions and use magic and might to win the day. And as you explore throughout the world of Sanctuary, you'll progress through a variety of dungeons to earn new loot and progress in the main story. Also, the game features six different classes and PvP mode. Overall, it's a great game and a launch very soon. Number 2. Marvel Future Revolution Today, not on any world. Kill them! This one's a triple-A quality open-world MMORPG that promises an original storyline that begins with the creation of the primary Earth after numerous Earths in the multiverse converging. You'll play as an agent working for the newly created Omega Flight superhero team working to protect primary Earth from dangerous threats. There's eight Marvel characters to choose from at launch. In addition, Marvel Future Revolution will include a bunch of game modes for players to enjoy. You can expect boss raids, 10v10 matches, special operations, and lots more. The game is set to be released globally in September, but now they've soft-launched in Canada for both Android and iOS, so if we got any Canadians in the house, be sure to comment down below. Have you tried this out? Let us know what you think! Number 1. Legend of Neverland This is an MMORPG set in a universe called Kabbalah. Something strange is happening in this utopian world, and it's up to you to protect the innocent civilians who are being attacked by the evil forces. 
After designing your character's appearance, you can start exploring this open world with more surprises than meets the eye. You can switch multiple classes freely and enjoy the fun of fighting. Also, the game features lots of quests and missions which you can complete and earn the reward. Overall, it has outstanding graphics and gripping backstory where you will discover your character's magical abilities. So there we have it, 10 best MMORPGs of the 2021. I'm Sam from Down to Top. It's been a pleasure. Like usual, I keep you up to date on the best mobile games as they release, so subscribe for more awesome content. Peace!